What's going on everybody? It's your boy, the low key legend. Fuck y'all doing today? I'm doing all right today. I got a special video here, man, because I still got my job, yo. This shit lit. Nah, I'm, I got, I'm on a new machine today and um, I, I never get to go on this machine. So I figure I'd throw some gameplay, fucking not gameplay. So to throw some footage up for you guys. I don't know why I said gameplay. But this is episode six of the vlog series, man. So if you guys do enjoy, be sure to smash that like button. And I guess let's just dive on into it. So what I'm gonna be showing you guys today is I'm, gonna, I'm driving this machine right now that I don't normally drive every day. This is actually a cherry picking machine is what it's called. I'm gonna show you guys what it is. And uh, I, I figure I'd turn this into a video because I'm probably never gonna drive this thing again. The only reason I'm driving it today is because the dude who's supposed to drive it is not here today and his job is so fucking easy man all he does is go goes around and picks up garbage from the entire warehouse very simple task i was lucky enough today to be able to take over that task so i'm gonna show you guys what exactly i'm on right now what the concept is of it if you guys really don't give a fuck i'll see y'all later in a new video but enjoy episode six of vlog man all right boys so what we're looking at here is the actual cherry picking machine this is the one i'm driving it's pretty old compared to the other ones here's a couple more we have in the back those are actually out of order these are out of order i don't know why they're out of order it just says do not use yeah they look pretty dope there's a smiley face right there as you can tell these are the normal ones though that we are using on a day-to-day -day basis um they're made by crown the company same people who make the forklift and it's actually pretty dope the way it works so what these machines are used for is you would strap yourself into that harness around your waist and then you would take this thing right here and attach this to the actual harness so you don't fall and this shit's actually connected like super good in case you were to fall but the only reason you would drive this is to go up there and get the boxes on the higher level for certain people who pick shit out for their order and uh, this one's charging right now here's the here's the engine of it i don't fucking know shit about the engine or nothing but this thing closes you take this thing off once it's done charging from wherever the charging spot is plug it into here close it up you would come over here turn the key and then this thing would light up it'll tell you you know give it a sec and to drive it, it's actually a pretty simple process, man. All you do is you step on that thing right there to get it going. This thing is to turn, so you spin it in whatever direction you want to turn. And this goes forward and backwards, and then there's also a horn right here. But it's not working because it's on charge right now. Here's the gun you would actually use to do it. Like, you'd have to sign in and, you know, do a bunch of bullshit, and then you uh, find the order on the gun and make sure, you know, it's good that way just for the computer systems to know what the fuck you're actually doing. I want you to go up in the air for me. Watch for this pipe though. I got you right here. Safety first. Safety first, boys. Y'all know how to rock the safety first. with that so you can see you can get those if you really needed to that's ultimately how it works in a nutshell it's cool isn't it though cool big cool that's all I do all day I'm gonna <laughs> cool that bitch Watch out for that pipe, bro. Are you gonna have enough room? Yeah. Oh yeah. That should be the exact amount of room right there. Like, oh my god. god. Bro, look how close he is. Gee, they should have made that pipe a little bigger, dog. That's how these things work, though. This man right here just got done working his shit. That's the harness. You can see he's clipped up back there. And then the engine. Where the fucking battery is right here. Boom. That 
That's a little more uh, footage of the cherry picker. I don't have to do that today. Today, I'm literally going around collecting garbage in here, and this is the one I'm driving. So I'm gonna show you guys kind of how this one works. It's relatively the same way, but this is like, because this dude's been here for like nine years, and he actually got his own machine. Like, I don't know if he paid for it or not that I don't think he did, but he kind of just claimed it, and it's been on here ever since. So I'm gonna take you a basic rundown of it, what it actually is or what it does. So right here is the ignition. I'm gonna turn it off and then turn it back on so you guys can see. It says self-test, it shows a little bullshit, shows the percentage. Please complete daily checklist. Uh, just some bullshit with that. Here's how you turn. So if you guys see right here, that means the wheels are straight. Kind of just, you know, a little diagram maybe of, <laughs> of the wheels. So if I turn this thing this way, you see this will actually, oh, hold on. I gotta step on it first. The other one had a little, you know, a little circle thing right there. This one's got an actual paddle. So when I press the paddle down, then I can actually move the tires and shit. So I can, if I move them this way, you'll see this thing go from yellow and then to red. Red means the wheels are all the way this way. Just so you get a relative idea. So if I spin it this way, it does the same thing. It goes back to red and vice versa. So it's back to, you know, straight tires now. This shit, I don't really know what this is. Never used it, never used this, but it's just an emergency disconnect, I guess. This thing right here, man, this will actually take us up and down. So if I use this, which I think I can right now, it's gonna take us all the way up. Like, I mean, it won't go all the way up cause we'll fuck ourselves up up there. But if I put this up, I hope I don't hit nothing. But this, this thing right here, this is go up and down. So like, we're pretty high right now, G. You can see like, that's how you would get to those levels over there and get those. And then this thing goes down. But this one is solely for getting garbage. So what I have is if you guys see all the way down there, those little, uh, you know, forklift things I showed you in my last vlog, I pick up this thing, which is like a pallet. And then I throw this cardboard box on here. And what I will go around and do is every garbage can I see, I just fucking kind of empty and put in here. And then I bring them back to over here and throw them in the compactor, okay? The compactor works pretty simple. And again, man, I'm making this video simply because if something does happen to me here, like I will always have this on my channel, which is fucking dope. So this is how it's set up. I guess you just turn this shit on. I don't really fuck with this ever, but you would just press this. And then this thing will come down and crush whatever cardboard you have. And if you have shrink wrap and shit, we usually throw it in here. And then I'll, you know, once it's full, I'll throw it in here. And there's a spot that is like right by the, our office that we just, there's a big ass dumpster on the outside. So we'll take it out there and, uh, you know, I'll throw it in there from there. But it is, yeah, this shit just kind of closes. You know, regular compactor shit. You feel me? This shit loud as hell though, getting right next to it. So it'll, it'll do that, do its thing. I got a fucking, you know, a little thing to pick up shit if it really matters, but other than that, man, I'm just gonna get some quick footage of me driving this shit real quick, bro, so y'all can actually see how it works. Without me stepping on this paddle right here, guys, if I were to just try to go, this shit will not let me at all or reverse. This is how you reverse. There's a horn button right here. <laughs> the horn on this one though is like old. You could tell it's fucking dying. <laughs> like that shit is just, it's been outused, I'm guessing. A lot, but that's the basic concept of this thing, bro. It's pretty fucking dope. They got a cage right here with a walkie talkie, um, you know, to communicate with people. Walkie talkies are dope as fuck too. Like you can switch nine through each, ten, each channel. Eleven. Sixteen. There's sixteen channels to choose from. I'm usually hang out on channel. Nine. Eight. I usually hang out on channel eight. You know, me and my uh, you know, two friends, but you're supposed to be on channel two to communicate with everybody. 
and you know they'll let you know if you need you know anything I, they really usually don't though so that's straight with that that one I never drove same thing with that one but those are the ones that we usually be driving and like I said man you if you if I wasn't doing garbage I would have a fucking a pallet back here and I would drive this around and I'd have a clipboard that shows me where everything is in the warehouse and I'd have to literally go and pick that shit out part by part which is pretty fucking dumb but that's where I work man that's that's the shit I do right now but it's new to me man and this shit i'm not gonna lie this shit's cool learning how to drive this learning learned how to drive this that was a fucking dope little experience i guess and uh, also there's like a safety feature so if i was driving on this thing this thing goes up and now oh my god bro that's not supposed to happen bro this thing is up usually that's a safety feature bro if these things go up oh my god if these things go up though on those ones because those rails go up as well, then it won't move. But I guess this, this one's that old that it doesn't even fucking matter if these things are... That's fucked up, bro. That's crazy as hell. But like I said, man, this one isn't used for going up and down, really. This specific one is only job is to drive along the floor and stop at certain garbage cans and pick them up and shit. But bro, that is really all I wanted to share in this episode of Vlogman because I wanted to make one on this thing. I didn't think I was gonna have the chance to ever because I only drove it like one or two times. And now that I'm on this bitch, I figure I'd drop a video, man, on how to just fucking around on a cherry picker, some basic shit. I'm gonna uh, have to drive this bitch around for the next couple hours and hopefully the day will go by decent bro but other than that man that's really all i wanted to hit at in this video this episode of vlog showing y'all a cherry picker um and i'm gonna upload this just in case i get fired or some shit but i'm still here bro it's lit big lit and that's really all i want to share in this video bro so if you guys did enjoy be sure to smash that like button check out my youtube channel if you guys are new drop a like if you did enjoy other than that, bro, I'm going to catch y'all very shortly for a brand new video. So y'all stay safe, stay savage, stay low-key. It's your boy, the low-key legend. I'm out of here. Adios.